We are now on to our third Easter egg here in Cold War, and this one might be the toughest out of all of them in this entire game, and that's because we have to go against Legion for our final boss fight. But before we can even get there, we need to get up to Region 3 here in Outbreak, and I need to remember not only how to play Outbreak, but how to actually do this Easter egg. I've been trying to do all these Easter eggs in our return just based off of memory, but I don't know if it's possible for me to remember where each individual radio is on every single outbreak map. So I might have to look a few things up. Ooh, and I completely forgot about the symbol monkeys. Good thing I saw one right there. If I didn't see it, I would have had to look up a guide, but uh, you know what? I'm gonna try to do as much as I can without looking anything up. And yeah, you're not seeing things. I am using the street sweeper here. I think this is a pretty good option to use against Legion. I went back and watched some of my runs against them just to see what did the best because I have the worst track record against Legion. I, I always fail the first attempt. Hopefully we can turn that around today. But the street supers seem to do pretty well against the, the orbs you got to take out while fighting them. And for those of you eagle-eyed viewers out there, you can probably notice that I don't have my face cam on. And that's because my camera broke. I don't know what happened to it, but the shutter on it is just, it just will not open. It's stuck closed. So I brought it to a repair shop. Hopefully it'll be back soon. But for the time being, I'm just going to have to rock with either no face cam or have to dig out an old webcam. But for now, we just have to work with what we got. And what we got is no speed cola on this street sweeper. Holy, that temp is just short circuited my brain. The reload on this is insanely slow. But we started off with a bounty contract, basically. Let's go ahead and try to take this mangler out. Oh no, that wasn't, was that our guy? Oh, it was, okay. I'm not used to them not being HVTs. I'm too, uh, Modern Warfare Zombies pilled. And I'm going to go ahead and say it. I think uh, Modern Warfare Zombies, better version of Outbreak. What do we have to do here? We have the Gold Chest event and the Dragon D's event. Let's just knock those out. One of my least favorite parts about these Outbreak Easter eggs is the setup. It takes so long to actually get set up enough to do the boss fight. And with only like three contracts per region, there's not a whole lot of money to go around. But hopefully we can get lucky here and there with some of our rewards from these contracts and get set up faster than we normally would. I think it's all done. You eating good, dragon? You better give me something good for that. What you got for me? Ooh, a gallo. We can double shotty it up. I think uh, I'll probably leave it actually because I found an FFAR on the ground. I already know this is a pretty good option. So I'm going to leave it at that. This feels so weird. I haven't played Outbreak in forever. And this should about do it for our gold chest event, right? Yes, sir. What we got from it? Nothing. A whole lot of nothing, actually. All right, let's go ahead and grab our specimen. What's going on, dude? And put him in the tube. This is one of my least favorite events in Outbreak. This and the escort contract. They just take forever to do. Just let me kill something. Oh, and I have to remember that if they do end up breaking this, if I lose the main objective, we just lose completely. So no messing around. And hold on. I forgot I can apply blueprints. Let's throw in a nice blueprint to this FFAR. Throw this on. Come on. Oh, we got dial up or something. Why can't we upload this transfer a little faster? We need some gigabit over here. Why do all these zombies care about us uploading this skull? Who cares? Do zombies actually be looking out for each other like that? All right, what we get from that? We get no items. And I'm so out of practice. Let's activate our anomaly. Let's make our way on to the next area. And I could shoot this beacon to skip us all the way to region three, but I'm a coward and I don't think I'll be prepared enough. Now we're on to Ruka. What do we got over here? Oh, the black chest event. Let's go. Actually, I don't know how hyped I am about that. It's probably going to drop me a pack one chalice. That's not going to be much help. It's honestly kind of sad that we didn't see a whole lot of these maps be used for anything outside of Outbreak and a little bit of Fireteam, but Fireteam didn't really stick around. After some of the first weeks of Cold War, it just, it was like impossible to find a lobby. I feel like they did a pretty decent job with these maps. Like it all looks good. And honestly, Fireteam was pretty fun for them trying to make another version of like Blackout. But they just decided to keep going with Warzone. I'm not saying it was like the wrong decision to keep going with Warzone, but could have been another fun mode here. Because there's plenty of maps and a lot of extra space on a lot of these fire team maps, which I'm pretty sure all connect together. And we just won't get to see what it could have been like to have a whole like battle royale in these maps. Oh, an abomination. Look how little you are. What's up, little dude? These honestly look so tiny after playing Modern Warfare Zombies. Look at this little guy. How can you be scared of him? I kind of want to give him a pet. What's up, my dude? 
You're a little itty bitty. And now you're dead. Let's grab death perception and let's try to knock out our crystal event. Death perception is about to make this super easy. Actually, I probably shouldn't have said anything. I remember the time limit on this is actually kind of short. And even with death perception, I can mess it up. Oh, I forget what those are called. But I forgot they were a thing. It's kind of funny how they just have like jump scares hidden throughout. Oh, and here's our aether tool. Let's get this to legendary. Perfect. So now we'll be able to do the max amount of damage once we get to legion. Assuming we can get this all the way up. Pack a punched. And just for old time's sake, let's go ahead and uh, do some fishing. Something nice might come out of this little creek here. What do we got? Oh, huh? you know what? Better than having nothing. It's hilarious that they thought to just add this into Outbreak. They're like, you know what? People would like this. And what was that? Is that Jug? Oh, Deadshot. I'll take that. Whoa, buddy. I do not miss you, Tempest. Get out of here. Scram. They're literally just here in Outbreak to piss me off. All they do is disable vehicles, eat hot ship, and lie. These grapple guns are so sick. Please bring these back if we ever do a big open map zombies again. Or just in general. It'd be awesome to have these in Warzone. If I was around during Blackout, I would have been using these all the time. And let's knock out this black chest event. This used to be the event for grinding out weapon XP. You get so many zombies to spawn with each orb. I guess that's not used to be. You can still get some good XP for doing it, but I don't need any more. I'm good. I still might kill all the zombies though to try to get the points. That's one orb down. That's two. And that's three. Come on, give me a pack two chalice, please. Nope, only a bronze. Lame. At least we got our other weapon pack a punch though. Let's go ahead and do this transport contract. I almost completely forgot about this one. We only have a minute 30 to make it to each spot. You end up getting caught in traffic or get the car stuck, you're done. You gotta completely restart the Easter egg. It don't help that this thing's slow as shit. Yeah, I know there's an Ethereum extraction going on right now, but I got some fish to catch. Ooh, some salvage. Now the Tempest show up to do their literally only job in Outbreak just to annoy me. They're going to try to shut this car down, but I ain't going to let them. Oh, well, scratch that. Made it pretty close, though. Bye-bye, Mr. Rocket Ship. Now that we got Region 2 done and a good amount of points, we can go ahead and get this to pack a punch, too. I'm probably going to throw Brain Rod on this. And do we have enough salvage for Tier 3 armor? We do. On to Region 3. All right, we are finally on to Region 3, and that means the Easter Egg can start. We can finally go and look for the items we need to get this Easter Egg on the move. But first, I'm going to go ahead and complete these contracts. And look who decided to show their face. Come on. You're not safe out here in Outbreak. We literally just took you out. And you are absolutely weak as shit in Outbreak, too. There ain't no point to you even trying to fight back. You're already less than half health. And you should already be dead. Later, bitch. What you got for me? Two legendary weapons. Ooh, with M16. I might actually have to grab that. Gimme, especially since it's legendary. Let's throw our blueprint on this, but I do have mule kicks, so this is going to be my third weapon. Unless I take my second one, switch it out for the DMR, switch our M16 out for that, and then do one of these, and now that's my second gun. Cool. All right, all objectives are complete. Let's go ahead and start the radio step. Let's activate this. Wait, no, that's not the right one. I'm pretty sure I know where all the radio locations are at on Zoom. I think the first one starts here. Let's do it. Start the feedback. And then once we survive this wave, it'll tell us what station we need to put all the amplifiers on. And so far, the street sweepers kind of just been tearing through everything. Like elites, normal zombies, whatever it's thrown at me. The street sweepers done a good job. It's way better than I remember it being. So I'm feeling a bit more confident going into this boss fight. But we still got a lot to do. So we need to set it to a static noise 8. Yeah, I'm here, Maxis. She's trying to call us from her, like, cell back at Requiem HQ. We need to set all these amplifiers to the right thing so we can hear her. Let's set this one to eight. There we go. I'm working on it, Maxis. I just gotta remember where the next two radios are at first. Here's one. There we go. Do I still need more? There we go. That one's all set. Now what you got for us, Maxis? Nice little ball, ball, ball. Requiem. It's me, your friend, Maxis. Yep. I need a favor, more than a favor. More than a favor? Take this device to the beacon. I will say more when I know the line is secure. You got it. Let's go plug our burner phone in. And now that we took our time saving, we can go ahead and get this to pack three. 
can't afford really anything else. All right, what you got to say to us, Maxis? Are you there? Yep. Good. That device isolates a special frequency all beacons share. Requiem cannot listen in right now. So it's just me and you, Maxis. You remember Ravanov? You should. It's hard yeah, to forget. Yeah, I know forget. that guy. He's in the mountains. He needs my help. I need you to find him. You bet. Let's go look for our boy. Now we need to go find all those dead drops that he left around. And since we found all the radios without a guide, I'll try to find all the symbol monkeys without a guide. Shouldn't be that bad. As I'd hoped, Requiem do not know that we are speaking. Ravanov has intelligence about an Omega operation in the Urals. He left me a dead drop. As I am still being detained, I need you to go. Look for his mark. It will be nearby. You got it. It's insane how like one of the most pivotal missions and actually one of the missions that is setting off the BO6 storyline wouldn't have happened if Max just didn't sneak around. Where are you hiding this tape at, Rabinov? You don't gotta be that sneaky with it. I'm the only one here. Oh, here's a monkey, but is this the right one? Oh, it has the M. Let's go. I've always made the joke that this is Maxis and Rabinov's sex tape, but it actually might have uh, some value or like it might actually be real because Maxis and, and Rabinov and I guess Dr. Gray kind of got in there somehow too. They all got a kid and that's Ava Jensen. They took their thruple and they freaked it. Now let's see what kind of dirty nasty they got hiding on this. Operatia Inversia. Did Requiem tell you of it? Did Weaver? If they didn't. I am not surprised. For a long time, we didn't know what it was, if it was even real. But Ravanov, he told me he found it. This must be it. The missile silo in Ruka. Oh, Ravanov, you need to get checked, dude. That's what your shit look like? Ravanov heard nasty. You nasty, nasty. Ooh, a close-up picture of it, too? Gross. You must travel to Ruka. Find Ravanov. We must try to stop this. Mm, what if I don't, Maxis? What are you gonna do about it? Fine, I guess I'll save the whole world. Gosh. Alright, where you at, Rabinov? I'm coming. I already got both my main weapons back a punch three. I see no need to go and do these other events. Let's just hope I can keep the downs to a minimum. And speaking of minimum, what's up, little guy? You wanna die? There you go. I don't even need to break all of his faces. He just dies like that. Idiot. Going down. Whoa, that's why they call it that. Let's see if I can remember how to do everything inside of here. I feel like I've done this Easter egg enough to where this part of the Easter egg shouldn't be too bad. At least figuring out the steps mentally. Actually getting them done is a whole other thing. Oh, here's the lockdown. Lift that. Let's head on up. Very convenient body and rope. Let's use it, shall we? What's up, Rabinov? You just take care of business real quick. I'm not going to do anything. He's actually such a monster. Messing all these dudes up with ease. DDT on. What's up, slime? Where is Maxis? She's at home. She's grounded. Still being held by Requiem. They don't want me in the field. They do not trust you. But we do know what is at stake. Yes. Why are these the only two people that know what's going on with these rockets? How, how does Weaver and them not know? I need you to find the keys. That is the only way we can put an end to Operatia Inversia. Fine. I'll find all the keys. You go inside that room and, uh, you know, do what you do. This power is too dangerous for either Omega or Requiem to possess. So I say we dump them in the middle of the Pacific. You mean like where Terminus is? Go. Find the launch keys. I will prep the missiles. Gold. Now let's get these keys. These are all going to be mimics, so go ahead and spawn in. You fat fucks. Let's just get them all spawned. And light them up. Ooh, this is actually so nasty. Mimics are going down like nothing. Oh, until I got to reload. Hold on. One moment. I just need one whole business day to get this done. There we go. All right, now you guys can all die. There you go. I'm sure there's still some left in there that I didn't activate. Oh, we can handle them. Oh yeah, here's a few. Let's get this over with, fellas. 
Completely unnecessary. We do not need to kill 800 mimics, but we can grab the key from this gentleman or another mimic and he will go down just as easy. Give me that. Now, which one is this? Okay, this is the jellyfish. I need to find the ethereum canister. Here it is. We gotta lift it and then go actually grab some shards for it. Can you drop me some? Appreciate it. Give me these. I will take every drop of them that you got. All right, let's see if we got enough. Oh, let's go. Perfect. I just gotta defend it. I might as well use my cashmere here because we're gonna end up losing them anyways when we get this essence trap for the next step. Is this done? Gimme. I'm just gonna go right here and pop it. Pick me up. I love how this jellyfish looks. It's so beautiful. I hope we see more of these in BO6. But where is the key at? Oh, there we go. Got it. Must have been in that guy's eyebrows. And now that that's done, we just need to go find our last little piece. Now, where is the essence trap for this guy? Oh, there it is. Okay. Let's throw a quick little nade. Can I not pick this up? Oh, there we go. Let's make sure he's in a spot where we can go and retrieve this essence trap. I want to put it in a bad spot that I can't get to. Yeah, this don't look like a good one. Go ahead and teleport, buddy. Oh, there he is. Let's see. Can I get up close enough without alerting him? Nope. Well, let's throw that down and see if he comes back. Oh, he did. Go for it. Get it. Come on. You know you want it. Is really not close enough? Let's throw it a little bit closer. Oh, he moved. Okay, he's going to be right here. Let's throw it. No way that scared him. How am I supposed to do this? Okay. We're going to sneak up. Throw it nearby. Go ahead and go get it. It's free. Free food, dude. We don't like free food. Come on, man. Why are you not getting it? Is it really too far away for your liking? That's messed up. Oh, target in range. Use it. I accidentally switched out my weapon. No. Did we trap him? Oh, we did. Got that all done while fighting some abominations or megatons or whatever the hell they're called. Give me that. Now we got all the keys. Now let's see if I can get this going. We gotta get all these started in order. Which one are we at right now? We're at A. Let's flip the switch. Okay. Incorrect. Don't start with A. Ooh, he just said BDA one kill. Maybe that's uh, that's the token we gotta do. We are in B right now. All right, let's do it. B. That works. No, it didn't. I got fooled. So it starts with D. Is it gonna be dab? Let's go ahead and try it. Starting with D. A, is that right? It is? It is gonna be dab. Where's B? Which way to B? Right here. Oh, did I go the wrong way around? I did. That's all right. I think we got plenty of time. By plenty of time, I mean 10 seconds. Oh, we got it. Let's go. Only took a little bit of trial and error, but we got it. Let's go ahead and craft us some cashmeres. Is there anything else I can bring? I already got a death machine. I already got Semtex. I think that's it. I think that's all we can do. I can probably get some armor or something, but I have Frenzied Guard. I'll be able to get it back. Oh, and that timer's already starting. Let me at him. Come on out, Legion. You may have beaten me literally every other time, and it might take multiple tries to take you out. All the last few times I fought you. This time it's going to be different. I'm giving it one try. And that's all we'll need. Let's see if I remember how to fight him. Spawn him in. Start lighting him up. We got to get his chest cavity open. Go ahead and bust it open for me, buddy. Go for it. Don't be shy. Let me see what you got hiding in there. Let's see the goods. Almost. Are you going to teleport? You are, coward. And we went into this without in a wonder weapon, so there shouldn't be too many zombies spawning this time around. But don't mean it's not going to be a lot to deal with. Oh, and they dropped the death machine. That's actually so good. Hold on. Let's use the one we got. Clear out some zombies. See if we can bust his shit open. There we go. And let's bring out the street sweeper. Let's use our frenzy guard. That's one orb down. No, Mimic, you're always here to mess this up. Did we even get them all? No, we didn't. 
Oh, we don't even need to get them all. Just breaking one's fine. And while this death machine's still on the ground over here, let's light them up. Let's also take the mimic out just for payback. Fuck you. And let's get them to bust it open again. Okay, that's gone. Give me that death machine. This is perfect. I'm feeling good about this run. Maybe I shouldn't say that before it's over. But we gotta bust it open. Let's work on the next orb. There we go! He's already less than half health. We only got one orb left. Let's throw a cashmere so we can get another frenzy guard and get our armor back. Oh, and an insta-kill. This is actually perfect. Let's try to get him to bust it open again. Oh, he's gonna Kamehameha me. Oh, and there's another cashmere on the ground. Oh, and we must have kept one from using a uh, mule kick. Let's do this. Let's throw another just for fun. And I need you to bust it open one more time for me, buddy. Come on. Let me see what you got hiding in there. The Legion's got that BBL. BBL Legion. BBL Legion. There we go. Let's get up close and personal. And hit him with the death machine. Oh no, Mimic Bad! Do not knock me. You are not allowed. Oh, we couldn't get it broken. Mimics have to ruin everything, dude. They always pull me away from it. And I do not appreciate it. And we just keep the the cashmere's coming. Mule kick's really helping out. It's coming in clutch. Uh-oh. Very low health. Let's frenzied. Let's kill the mimic. Where'd you go? Come on, we're so close to taking you out. Open up. Almost there. Let's take care of the Mimic before he wants to mess this up again. Any other Mimics roaming around? Yeah, I didn't think so. Take out the Death Machine. Where's your orb? Show me. Let me see your balls. There we go. All dead. Perfect. One try is all we needed, baby. Let's go. Get out of here. Go back to wherever the hell you come from. The hole in the sky. Woo! That was actually maybe my best run against the legion ever we clean that shit get those missiles out of here send them to terminus we'll have to deal with that in bo6 so what's up to raptor Max, one you'll need a ride out of here oh max has spilled the beans her going behind his back and all but there weren't no way i was gonna leave y'all hanging yeah you're a real one raptor one let's get out of here literally one person well i guess three people but one person doing all the heavy lifting just can take out all of omega's plans and what a beautiful stat line here almost 2,000 kills 273 crits no revives and no downs we did it flawlessly let's go dude and the next thing we have on the docket is the second outbreak easter egg we gotta go fight orda now at least that's what you guys told me if i'm doing it out of order this one's on you. But that's all I got for you guys today. Thank you for watching. Hopefully my face cam will be fixed within the next few days. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.